Hi guys, Chef Kevin Belton here. Hope you're having a fantastic day. Now, you know, today I want to do something a little different. I don't know if you guys like a Reuben sandwich. Well, we're going to do a Reuben roll-up, okay? This is something that you can make for the kids as a snack. This is great for a movie or a game, whatever you want. Basically, what I'm using for this is puff pastry. Now, you know, your typical Reuben is corned beef, Swiss cheese, sauerkraut. But I have a little twist because... Instead of Swiss cheese, I'm gonna use Gruyere, all right? And this is what I'm talking about. Use what you like. So here I have the puff pastry. I've let it defrost, and I have it just sitting on a piece of parchment paper. So we're gonna take our cheese. Now, if you use sliced cheese, you can just lay your slices down. But because we're going to roll this up, you wanna to try to keep things about a half inch away from the edges, okay? But look, I just shredded this cheese we're gonna do a little shredded cheese. There we go. Now let's take our corned beef. Look at that, doesn't that look gorgeous? So we're gonna lay our corned beef down. Ah, uh, yes. And you know, we can, you notice how I'll put some toward, one, toward the end so we have some on the ends. If you notice, I'm not layering them exactly even just because I want to get toward the ends on both sides now let's take a little bit of sauerkraut now with the sauerkraut what I've done with it I've taken it I've rinsed it and I've drained it really good all right you can see how dry this is because we don't want this moist we don't want this wet so I've rinsed it to get rid of that brininess okay and drain it, you know, just wring it out really well. So get that spread out. And you can use more or less, you know, depending on what you like. Now, here's what we're gonna do. The reason I put this on the parchment paper because I can get it started. So we wanna pick this up. And we just want to roll. Just roll, come on in, stay tight, stay tight. Stay in, stay in. There we go. All right. Now, here's what we're going to do. I'm going to kind of cut off this end. Because what we want to do, we want to cut this in sections. I have my pan here lined with parchment paper. Now, if you don't want to use parchment paper, you can use a grease sheet. But we're going to cut them and just lay them on our parchment paper. And these are gonna bake roughly for about 18 to 20 minutes. Oven's preheating at 400 degrees. Now, what I have here is caraway seeds, okay? And because this is typically served on rye bread, that's why I'm using a little bit of caraway seeds right on the top, okay? As much as little as you want. So let's go ahead in the oven and get these baked. And like I said, they'll go in for about 18 to 20 minutes. Don't they look toasty and delicious? Now, of course, this is always served with a little Thousand Island dressing. So here, let's just go ahead and put a few right here on the plate. And we have our Thousand Island dressing to go with it. So I tell you what, try this recipe. It's nice, it's simple. Remember, put in the things that you like. Thank you for cooking with me today. Keep washing those hands, stay safe. For WWL TV, I'm Chef Kevin Belton, and we'll see you soon.